this is Technomancer for zero point fuel I wanted to give you guys a look at the AC induction test rig I have set up uh, this is basically a three phase uh, AC motor that's been wired as an induction generator it's being driven by a DC motor the chains only temporary I plan on using a, a gear a belt drive like off a motorcycle it needs to be a three to one ratio so this is just temporary uh, so I, I can't be out of range here this is a uh, it's just basically a, a 4.2 amp 500 watt inverter being driven by some batteries okay and walk around here this is the coming from the inverter the amperage and this is the drive motor voltage and amperage now underneath this there's two bridge rectifiers tied to a cap box which you can see right here this is uh, the capacitor box is being driven by the inverter to power the DC motor but there's also a set of a bridge rectifier that um, is running from the induction generator and this is the induction generator voltage uh, and that's tied back into the cap box so as the motor increases the, and the generator kicks in it's dumping energy into the cap box which is causing this number to drop and this number to climb so they're not equal um, now obviously the ratio is not right so the amount of torque being generated by the load is not equivalent so it's not over unity folks okay but what I'm going to show you is this system and how it works currently to give you an idea of what's going on so first off I'm going to go over here and turn the inverter on and then I'm going to turn on the variac start the variac working and you can see it starts climbing voltage right away here. and it's got 0.6 or 0.7 amps and it's 7 it's not making enough power yet so at 34 volts, we're making 25 volts on two phases. So we're going to take that up a little. 42. So we're at 34 volts, using 46 volts at 4.9 amps, but we're only drawing 3.4 from the system. Uh, that's kind of how it's working. Now the motor can be wired a couple different ways. And uh, until I have the gear ratio right, uh, we're not going to get any spectacular uh, results. But using an AC motor as an induction generator absolutely works. Um, it can be wired a couple different ways. Um, one is more torque. It takes more torque, but it makes more voltage than the other way. So this is basically it. This is a test bed for an AC induction generator. So this is Technomancer for zero-point fuel. Signing out.